Okay, hello and welcome, welcome, welcome. It's actually been, uh, I don't know, a week since I've been able to play last, and that makes me very, very sad. But it is what it is. Is this the Brass Order? I'd love to stop them from being able to settle that spot. I wonder if that would happen if I if I if we went to the Royal Woodlands. So it's been a while since we played. I'm still having a great time with the game. Really want to keep playing, doing more and more. Um, but damn, sometimes schedules get busy. And yeah, I did hear that blocking settlements means that they don't just go somewhere else in that time. They need to pack and plan for another zone. So I don't know that going one tile away would do anything i think it would just limit the amount of territory that they capture but that's fine because there's a whole bunch of areas over here that we want to see um we could also just start exploring out in these other directions but uh no i think i want to start messing with the brass order uh one second i think we have spent all of our stuff we usually do this at the end of the round so i'm just making sure 36 food does not seem like enough we need 60 though oh my god 78 machinery are you kidding me that's insane all right so here we go um let's just look at the modifiers first the restless spirits can be found in the forest and it's impossible to recognize which ones are dangerous glades or not that's pretty tricky to begin with uh, then we're looking at these two options, 8 versus 9. This has more people, not to mention the people coming here. Now, the problem with the high population start is that on Viceroy, it becomes more and more difficult. More reputation required to win. So Viceroy or Prestige 1. I think we do a Viceroy run. And then we start looking at maybe doing prestige, but this is already going to be quite hard. So let's go high population. That's going to be kind of tricky in the first situations, but we haven't played with the lizards in very uh, long. We're going to get resin. We're going to be able to get eggs and meat here. The lizards will like that. Um, I do like sea marrow. It doesn't look like we have any opportunity to get metals to make tools, which is probably our highest uh, level importance. Going for the small farm, though, that is something I am into, my lord. So we're going to get that. Gain one additional cornerstone recharge. I don't think so. We have one point. A um, couple extra eggs. A little bit extra extra wood. 42 more wood makes it so that our, our start can be pretty lightning fast, to be honest. Okay, okie dokie. Never-ending rain, baby. All right, so what do we have here? Um... Uh, during drizzle events, every dangerous and forbidden glade event you complete gives you 30 raw food. That's kind of meh. Like, it's not going to help. Like, it's nice if it happens, but I don't have to go out of my way. It's not like the one that gives us prestige. Uh, and then our events here is all resolve drops faster. That's pretty scary for us. If people don't have housing, they have frustration that keeps stacking up. Um, this is another stacking one for housing and complex food. So at least it's already housing related, but now it's complex food as well. And then finally, uh, production buildings also generate blight lot during the storm. That's kind of, kind of nasty. There's some danger there. There are some flax fields, so that will help us. And there are some roots. Now look at the, oh my Lord. So we need, um, a woodcutter's camp. To clear out the area here and we need a woodcutters camp down there let's let our people get to work on that we'll get the initial road set up um you know what though not not back here because we're gonna need a woodcutters camp there because we have no room and then let's see we know that in terms of food we're gonna be getting a harvesters well not food we're gonna get a harvesters camp there and a uh, food camp for scavenging over here. Though hopefully we can get... Oh, actually, we should have looked at our buildings first. Um, again, simple kilns and stuff is nice, but we have no way of producing tools. So crystallized dew is more so what we'll be looking for. Planks and flour is actually really powerful, though, because we already have the small farm. So let's go for the planks here. 
And then the trapper's camp, I know will be good for us. Like, I just know it will be. Don't get me wrong, a ranch would be nice as well. You know, we have a lot of plant fiber nearby. So maybe that's a way of getting leather and eggs for the rest of the game. All right, we'll try that out. And then um, we already have flour. We don't have tools. So I think we're just going to grab bricks or coats. Um, I think we're going to go for bricks. We do need complex food at one point. But the fact that we already have some... Uh, the fact that we already have some... Excuse me. The fact that we already have small farms and the ability to produce flour makes me feel as though producing uh, producing complex food is actually going to be somewhat straightforward for us. So there we go. So far, so good. We have four people here. So a harvester. And our first corner stone. Pack production, we don't need it yet. Grain production. Every 25 times you make grain, get more grain. I think that's incredible. I love burnt to a crisp, but I think the grain one, it might not come up later. And I already know, because we have small farms unlocked, that that's what we're gonna be looking for. So that's pretty powerful. You're good, you're good. Um, You know, there's one thing I'm realizing that we're missing. And that is the ability to make... Oh, I did it again. I made the the makeshift post as opposed to the crude workstation. Sometimes life is hard. Uh, that means that certain things will be nice. Stone cutters camp though and some bricks, not bad. Lizard's resolve being good is something that we want. 12 tools, we have no way of doing it, but my God, is that bonus nice. But let's make our lizards happy. Um, trading a lot, building, like, this is production increases, we're gonna take that, not to mention the six tools, and then dangerous glade events for a tool shop, that will be very powerful for us later, I am into that, absolutely yes. Uh, how many builders do we have? None, okay, well, you're off the hook there, and you're not actually gonna make pack crops, I lied to you, um, no 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 we are instead going to make five planks and two bricks and if you can find stone you find stone um before the storm hits we do need the last um our last boy to keep focusing on some housing and there we go we're pretty well set up we got some good stuff going on here i mean I can make both of these higher priority and then turn fabric on is what I'm thinking. Because this right here will give us clay eventually. You know, for that reason, it might be worth, um, as soon as this builder is done, going for that. I don't want to take uh, the person off grabbing roots because that is just so important already. Also, one thing I learned about the warehouses is the small warehouses that you build are connected. Like they teleport. Um, like all the resources in the game. So you don't need to carry things from small warehouses to your main one or anything like that. Once it's in a warehouse anywhere on the map, all warehouses have access to it. And that is not at all how I thought that worked. Oh, sorry. No, 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 no. Finish, finish building. I took them off like a moment too early. Come on. But for us to make bricks, we need to grab fabric because the fabric has the chance of giving us the clay and the clay is what we need. We don't have any yet, but that doesn't mean we haven't found any. See, there's two. Not bad. We do have some homeless and we are at a level one of anger, but it will go up. And it's a pretty nasty modifier. So perhaps I will, in fact, build an extra shelter. And I don't know. I really do want to cut into a new zone. But we take them off. 
that brings us to level zero and that is a big deal for us and then this will also help the resolve and we're good okay so another crude workstation another work camp and it's good that we have some cutting that is continuing and this this guy is mostly focused on just clearing out the space nearby it's uh this cutter down here that we will say cut into the new zone as soon as you can we really don't want it to be a dangerous zone but that is the uh gimmick of this uh this thing so you're done now i hope you got something in that time get out there and get to work trade hub one reputation every time you sell a bunch that is good i think that um 10 more charges is also really good i'm gonna go with the 10 more charges that can be that can be big the plus one housing is so convenient you know what, I'm going to do plus one housing, because I think that that is going to make it so our lizard homes are going to be just sick. Um, can we please talk about the supplier? We do have enough for the supplier now. We're going to give supplier the prime real estate right here. And you, sir, are done making planks. Um... Let's see what we're getting for people. Humans and harpies. I do like those, sure. And let's think about this. We need lizards to love life. What do lizards need to love life? We're going to need jerky and pie and all that other stuff. Pie is pretty high on my list of things to do. This looks like a dangerous glade, not going to lie, uh, by the amount of goods that we're seeing. And this is a, a, a tremendous requirement. So that's kind of scary. This is the ghost, though. So the actual event is probably this. You're going to kill five villagers if I can't give you a ton of fabric. I mean a ton of fabric. Um, Harpy, get in here. Oh, wrong, wrong button, wrong button. Not bricks. We're making fabric. Fabric, fabric, fabric. That is... Um, it's dangerous. It's going to take two minutes to complete. There's nothing that goes wrong while it's completing, though. And it could give us the ancient tablet. So we choose that? No. Um, or a ton of money. But I think the bricks and the, and the fuel are really what we're after here. So let's investigate. It doesn't hurt to start carrying over the fabric. We know it's not all ready yet. Here we have uh more beer and more barreling that's kind of nice too um pack goods or a brewery well if we have the brewery available to us and this gives us the tavern then i'm gonna go for the brewery um it only only the humans will like it so it's pretty expensive don't fell trees for 500 seconds that's um that's too long i would say isn't it isn't it? And it's not even that good. Like, 15 amber is good and planks are good, but it's not as good as all this stuff. I think instead you just go pack of crops and you, uh, I mean, 25% more uh, by all of your farms, basically. That's something that I can get on board with. We're, we aren't going to start producing it till we have some fertile soil. Um... But, you know, that's it is what it is. So you've got the first five, then you're getting another five. Happiness is fine right now. So let's get you off and you on. And then you're in there. Lovely. And actually, this is the a specialization bonus for the harpies. So I'm actually, I'm wrong. You guys go here. We will have enough fabric. I'm not worried about that. Uh, and you're just gonna make planks, my dudes. And look how happy the harpies are. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So, two planks for five wood. That is something I can get on board with. Water skins, a little bit expensive. Flour, not bad. Can we make, um, 
you out of flour or is it out of grain? It's out of grain that the packs of crops are. Okay. Um, we also want to talk about getting a trapper's camp at one point. And presumably a ranch would be nice. We did talk about it earlier. It's now becoming relevant. You're carrying the goods over. And this has started. Uh, it has not started. And by that I mean you guys stop cutting. And get down here right away. This is going to take a minute and a half. Upon arrival. There we go. Oh baby. We didn't lose half our population at the start of the freaking game. Let's freaking go. Is none of this harvestable? Okay well. Uh, that, that solidifies that. Fortunately for us. The stone cutters camp over here is going to be sick. This is going to be an awesome stone cutters camp. There's also the berries and stuff. Like I don't know. If to me, if the if the warehouse really does cut down the amount of travel time that everyone's saying it does, I I'm down building them so often, so frequently. I think that's just a tremendous idea. And you guys can make bricks now as well. In fact, they are pretty high priority, not going to lie, but that's fine. Packs of crops, I do want you... Um, you we have 30 minutes to get our act together. Probably 40 sea marrow is likely... Oh, no, sorry, the two, uh, the two tablets is what we're going to do. Very, very good. So what are you missing? You're missing fabric. We should have fabric coming once we drop it off. So that's that's nice. I'm having a great time so far, not gonna lie. Uh, resolve, resolve is low. And it's gonna drop fast if we get to level two. But for now, we're fine. Now scavengers camp can go for eggs. And that works out because again, we're building this here. Get another lizard over there. And you can start clearing up the area around this one. Uh, probably want to breach into one of these soon. So we'll put you into the task. Storm is pretty much over. Lovely, lovely. And now that we have the sea marrow coming in, we're going to stop burning the fuel. Or the, the logs that we're getting. Alright. So you're cutting into there. Very nice. This woodcutter's camp... Uh, I just moved you, but actually come here and get some get some people. One moment. Three grain per minute is nice, but we want to make grain. Plus 20. All right. Meat specialization. That is insanely good. But two ember for every sea marrow produced is like actually... Like all of those are really good for us. And we got lucky. Getting copper bars and an amber is quite nice. Um, all right, let's talk about this. Uh, we've got three of you. So one of you here. A couple of you here. We want housing probably next. So this harpy house is fine. This human house is is fine and then this uh da, 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 lizard housing is what we're gonna have to focus on after that okay and you can cut this we're gonna cut into two glades because i'm a crazy person let's double check yeah it is a small glade and my god it has what we need it has a small a small farm area which means that we're going to start getting grain, which means we can make the pack crops, which means that life is good. And what did you need? Complete two dangerous goods and do a bunch of things. You need me to get 15 harmony things. But we do have the tablets now. And this here is another small zone. Um, it has good stuff though. And you guys are presumably making fabric and bricks. Don't uh, don't use the stone anymore, if you can. 
This is a clay deposit though, which is quite nice. And even another flax field. So that beside the flax field is something that we can do. Get some pickers on it. This is gonna make grain and you guys are going to make it here. Uh, get a human and a person on it. The problem is that you need to not be on it for a second so you can build the zones. The farming plots. Okay, we don't have we don't have very much time for you. We only have some time. Um, so I think that it's something that we have to do is start uh, getting some decorations built. I think is the most prudent piece here. One, two, three, four. Throw a fence down on the other side. It's just a little enclosure. And we know that after that we'll need two barrels. We'll need... Because we have to get to eight. And then we have a lot of planks coming in. So it seems fine that we would go after some... One, two, three, four. And then we need... How many? 15 of these. They are quite expensive. So let's take a moment to consider. Uh, burn 20 Blight Rot. That will happen. And plus coal production is nice. We already know about a bigger ale thing. What about the packs, though? M getting a bakery would give us pie. Six minutes, though, to make that many packs seems scary. I can make packs, and I can make them out of... A variety of things but like I hardly like we have no food so because we have no food we're just gonna go for the cysts which will happen complete dangerous events get an artisan I mean that's that's fine lizards resolve being high is is fine as well Neither of these really stick out to me. This is more likely to happen. Just on its own without without us worrying about it. So I'm going to go with that. Uh, are you not... Uh, are you making grain? Where are, you, where are you making the grain? Oh, you're harvesting already. Yeah, okay, never mind. So there's not, not any more time to plant. All right. You guys get building the decorations. As you can see, we need a couple more greens being built. We have plenty of population, so now it's four and four. And then we'll need yellow and everything else. We have the tablets for you. We just need 15 harmony, which is quite a bit. Again, it's very expensive. Um, I'd really like to make our resolve higher, and I wish there were some runes to fix. No, uh, no ghost in here, right? No. Okay. Well, maybe I'll just cordon off a space, you know, down here. And we can start building these fire pits. For our ghost. That's not enough, but it's gonna be a good start. Now this zone here, you guys have done fine. The lizards could probably deal with some more fancy housing just for them. And then again, we can put some more fire pits in. Cause I really want this ghost thing. This is the thing that's on a timer and it's going to be expensive. Where's the other ax cutters right here? Okay. Uh, you guys can move there. The freaking sea marrow is nice. We've got over a hundred of it. So that's very good. We need to talk about a, um, a blight post. Pretty much, pretty much now, to be honest. I'd rather get on it sooner than later. The food problem is certainly a problem. We can make flour, um next season but uh, oh uh we we have too many axe cutters right now it is pissing the spirits off that will make a big big improvement 
Lovely, lovely, lovely. You are a harvester's camp, and you are a scavenger's camp. We're gonna need either a second one of you. No, 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 what we need is to, to build this ranch, right? So this is a blight post, and now we're gonna get some ranches. In fact, we might even get two ranches because we can feed them grain. We just need to make sure that we don't use too much, uh, like, for flour, basically. Uh, actually, don't use, don't use any of that. Uh, what's the best, like, payout, though? No, we want to make meat because we have the meat specialty. No, we have the grain specialty. Okay. So, three to five or eight to ten. Uh, three to five seems like the best absolute payout on 50 seconds. We could go to leather. It doubles the amount of leather that we have. So, like, that's fine. Um, so, let's do that. Tell them they can use grain. But that means that our grain is going to be very, very taxed. So, we need a second farmer out here, I would say. Um, we do have the builders right now because we took the woodcutters off the line. So, that's fine. How many are we at? Eight, with a couple more things being built. Nine, looks like ten here. So, we need five more of these. And that's a lot of brick. One, two, three, four, five. Um, it's a lot of brick. Extraction tools, no. Harvesting, no. We're gonna do the. We're gonna do a reroll. None of these were great. All farms can plant mushrooms, no. Minus five fewer charges actually works out quite well for us because we already have plus ten. No, no, we didn't choose that. Still though, we're farming, so I think that this makes a lot of sense. So is that retroactive? I should have looked. How much is a ranch? Three. Yeah, yeah, you guys are still three. Okay, well, it is what it is. And the blight posts are still one of everything, but... That's fine. You guys are working hard. Lizards. Blight posts. You love working here. But harpies are effective working here. So why don't you guys work with the meat? And we're actually building two of these. More humans would be nice. More harpies would be nice. More lizards actually are what the ranches need, I'm realizing. So I should have, I should have let off with that. Uh, we also want a trading post here pretty much now. Um, you know, you guys can build it in this, this clearing over here. See if I care. Um, we do want these posts to be on a high priority, but it's tricky because, I mean, we need, we need so many resources, right? Harvester's camp has no resources nearby. Okay, fair enough. You're now free to go. One of you goes here, the other two of you go here, and get back on that wood cutting line, even if it makes people pissed. Uh, unless, actually, what was the lizard resolve before that? Nine? Yeah, no, no, no. We need, uh, we need the lizard resolve to go higher, yes. Oh, uh, let's not go all the way on that, actually, because we need, uh, some of these buildings to get constructed. And we are getting through these marrow posts pretty quick, but... Again, we have so much fire. And there comes the uh, structures. Very good. What do you want from me? You could take bone marrow, but you need me to complete dangerous events. Our food is low. That's probably the scariest thing that we have going on. Hopefully, you guys don't have enough freaking things to do this okay never mind then um and it's probably because this is taking up so much fiber oh but it shouldn't be taking grain uh one of you can help in the crude workstation 
And now we're going to start harvesting some grain. And hopefully, we'll start harvesting some grain over here as well. And then we'll be in a good spot. So 15 out of 15. Here's 40 sea marrow is probably... Is 20 sea marrow worth more than a... a, a, a ancient tablet it's really not so we'll get rid of this instead of the tablet and luxury goods barrels a perk and planks that was not worth it I'm just gonna say it I'm gonna say it out loud that was uh that wasn't worth it okay well you know it happens ship happens we need food we can make flour with the grain, but that's uh, it's not actually that good. It's just chilling. You guys stop using the wood. Yeah. Okay. That was that was very disappointing. Um, we should uh, we should get some new glades. Maybe I'm not convinced on any of this. Um, Twelve trade routes is is difficult. Forty good sold. I mean, are we, do we have a trader yet? Here's the thing. We could, okay, if we had meat and leather. How much leather do we have? Nine. If we bought meat and leather, we could make water skins, okay? Do we have enough money to do $45 worth of trading? No. Uh, in that case, religion 70 times. That works out for humans and lizards and will make everyone happy. Let's go for religion. We need lizards to be happy. We need a lot of things. Right now, only nine lizards have fancy housing though, so we should add lizard housing to the list. And we should potentially, we don't have any service buildings. Yeah, we need uh, we need this to get built. We need to get some trade going here. Oh, use the bone marrow. Right, because isn't, isn't the sea marrow taking um, three times this is less than a minute? And the sea marrow takes about three times this. Oh, well, they're, they're basically even, so use them if you got them. The wood can be used for other things like construction, making planks, what have you. So I feel compelled to use the, the fuel for fuel. And then next turn, next, uh, uh, you know, um, you guys need to stop cutting for a minute. And you guys can come over to this farm and you can prep it. Our trader got here. There's a ton of tools. So basically, we're going to sell our soul for tools. We do have money. Plus one to tool production is like actually insane. Uh, it does mean that we're low on funds, but that doesn't matter because we're going to buy as much as we can. $58 worth. Uh, well, here's the thing. Bone marrow. You can have 80 of it. Ten planks. Twenty planks. You can get the resin. Um... Is that enough for us to buy anything? Oil, perhaps? Tools? A brick? Okay, what if we sold all the resin for some brick? There we go. All right, 20 fancy tools. Uh, let's let's think about what our best thing here is. Barrel production is, is okay. Uh, you know what it is, though? It's time to cut into some new zones and use those fancy tools to uh, resolve the event. That's what we need to do. People are pretty uh, pretty upset right now, not going to lie. It's kind of a problem, and it's dropping a little bit faster than I can handle. 
So, turns out we're not cutting any trees so that people remain somewhat happy. You can leave. We need to complete some dangerous events or rebuild some structures. It's the only way for us to kind of stay on par here. We have too many things that are asking for that. Um, now is a very good time to be building the next set of barrels. One, two, three, four. And to be building, I think, what? The next set of blue bees. Uh, you know, we always wanted anvils. One, two, three, four. Oh, wait, that's the street. No, 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 no. Anvils. One, two, three, four. And then uh, we have stone. We have a lot of builders right now because we are not cutting during the storm, which means that it is time to upgrade the road network. Uh, even though we don't have to walk around it too much, this farmer sure does. All right, get to work builders. We got f six builders right now. And for the record, you guys need to cut this. And I mean, I said I had a bunch of builders, but I guess I really don't as soon as you consider the fact that uh, storm's already over. Ancient tablets, fine. Coal blight, fine. Additional things, I don't love these. I have a lot of fuel right now. Silent looting. That is insanely good. I love, I love the cookbook, but silent looting stops you from losing the game. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take these two humans, throw them down over here. And we are going to look to open as many of these things, these work, these uh, treasures as we can here soon. Uh, woodcutters get wood cut in. We're going to need to expand the harpy and human housing here in the short term. Which we can do. You have no more things to consume, eh? Okay. Uh, so that's the harpy housing. Then there's the human. And low on food. You're, you're not wrong. These ranches better be making some freaking egg. Uh, welcome new people well here's the thing you've provided an opportunity to welcome new people and we have to choose the welcome new people option so fine by me that's how it is stop making leather stop making leather you guys can produce more eggs is there anything here for this no Scavenger post is still scavenging, but realistically, they need to scavenge this stuff. Is this a dangerous area? It is. Okay. Minus 18 to woodcutters and gatherers. Gotta do it. We gotta get this mission done. It's gonna be very important for us. Uh, roots. No, we don't need any of this. Um, then what does this ghost want? Complete four trade routes. Okay. Well, we don't have any provisions, but that's fine. And we do need to rebuild something. So workshop for planks, fabric, and bricks. That's everything? Okay. Um, wood cutters need to stop cutting so much wood. And come over here and rebuild. And that's going to give us rebuild the ruin. That's going to give us dangerous events completed. And I think it's pretty well time to get somebody working um, here. Because we need provisions to be able to uh, trade. Right? With our trade routes. No provisions. So, bop, bop, bop. Um, we're going to get lots of grain and we honestly might even use more here, but like it is what it is. Um, lots of grain. And remember that we have that grain bonus here. So we've every 25 times it's produced. 
So we need to produce grain more to get more bonuses. You, finally, six tools, love it. Now, that's not enough, but it is, it is nice. This is no longer needed because we have the ability to get bricks and fabric over here. This is going to be another production area. It might even be worth getting a small hearth. That will reduce the amount of... The ghost is in the way. Okay, well, when this is gone, it'll be good. Um, that's going to reduce a bunch of travel times. Is this the front door? I bet you it is. This is going to be a small hearth. This is going to be a production area. We're going to add in a warehouse here so that we can farm and do everything better. We're going to add in a farmer's field. We're going to add in whatever we need to do it. We're going to tell it no vegetables. We just make grain. I don't know what we're doing for food, but if we're, we're going to figure it out. Uh, crystallized dew at the groves. I do love that. What do we have in here? This is a thing that we need the herbalist camp. This is something we need the herbalist camp. This is something we need the herbalist camp, but this is something we need the foragers camp. And it is a large broccoli. And that would be nice to, to kind of get from, but I think we're gonna reroll. I need something to use my grain. A temple for religion is important to me as well. It also would give us a service in our main uh, area of habitation. So you get a little path. It kind of upsets me when uh, this middle road section isn't stone. So I'm going to do that. This farmer does need to walk. So we'll do that as well. And we can set somebody to this. Keep making fabric and bricks. Can use leather. This, it's not the right season, but we can put a human out here for now. Low on food. So are you starving? Is that why you're upset? Minus one for hunger. Uh, and then this event is still going on. Okay, so not too bad. We, uh... This would give us, what, 40 herbs. This would give us a bunch of brick. One of these would give us food, right? No. Nine minutes for us to clear two glade events. We do have what you want. 40 more seems expensive, but... Um, claim. Oh, the blight perk. That's pretty good. Uh, we'll investigate with two people to get that as soon as possible. And then this is going to finish. Very good. 15 bucks, pretty nice. Um, most of these we can pretty much send to the queen, I think. So let's see if we can do that, because if we can just, every time we resolve one of these, we are going to get a, uh, a small bonus, right? A, hey, where, where is it, where is it? It's the silent looters. So we've gained minus 15 already, and we're going to gain some more here when these resolve. Which, I mean, would be nice, wouldn't it? We're now at, at 2. Good to know. Uh, time to set out another guy here. You guys can prep the fields. What are you making at the makeshift post? Okay, you're making what I want you to be making. This is ready to be delivered. The tool shop. Okay, interesting. At least two hubs at neighborhood level, we can do that. But these perks are not that good. Education and scrolls. Let's look at you. Your education. And scrolls. Okay, well, we can do that. We can do that. It's something that we want. The tool shop is something that we can build in here. And what do we got? What do we got? Smithy for more tools, planks, pie, baby. Pie. Let's let's double check our people here. 
pie and pie works both ways jerky's on everything don't get me wrong that's pretty cool but how much grain we got we got grain we got grain and we're making more grain but we could make jerky did we grab the secret recipe book no we grabbed the silent looters um what does jerky need will we have it meat and a fuel source well pie needs grain and anything here we could convert to meat production though if everyone on our squad likes jerky i can't say no to this that is kind of insane it is the perfect building so let's give it a priority slot oh we actually got something else as well biscuits and pie there we go there we go. i do like the pack crops what does the crop mission give us would give us 25 percent production at our farms that is it's quite nice actually but we don't need it but it would also give us pickled goods let's talk about pickled goods Pickled goods is something that is liked, but it's not loved by the others. No, I'm gonna grab the bakery. And we're gonna get we're gonna get our food situation sorted. Because quite frankly, that's what we needed the most of. Whoa, harpies, what's wrong with you? Why are you upset? Hunger for three. Well, um. Yeah, okay. I get it. I get you. I feel what you're saying. I hear it um and that's the thing right now we're using grain at our uh at our ranches so you know maybe i'm overvaluing our ability to uh to do certain things now you're down to minus one because somebody ate we have food or at least our our books say that we have food maybe we were just getting food in from something um you guys can keep scavenging what about beer production barrel production neither of these are that critical to be honest but it is it is kind of nice the herbs are considered a food maybe we just send some boys out here keep the goods okay did it uh is it gonna tell me that one left yeah okay harpy left it was a scout um i'm not sure what it was applied to probably this storm's almost over though we're gonna be fine we're gonna be fine come on don't don't go 0.3 wow okay never mind that was sad now can we make our people happier minus five to woodcutters is pretty bad um Every time you finish a trade route, that's fine. Brawling fulfilled is not really it. I guess we're just gonna take extraction tools because I don't really like any of these. Um, we can talk about trade routes now though. So we have oil. Is there anything here that we have that we really know we can get rid of? I mean, I guess it's just oil for 10 bucks uh stone cutters with no deposit tons of deposits over here you're making fabric and bricks what did you need four trade routes okay we're working on that my dude hooded trickster uh two epic perks yes yes holy damn that's gonna make people happy 27 dollars. can i get some money from you this is like an incredible trader oh my god are you seeing this like honestly take my take some pots man take some pots Okay, plus five to events. Okay, that's fine. 
That one was less cool. Um, 18. I mean, luxury goods? I'll give you my whole freaking run, really. Just give me that sweet, sweet, uh, goodness here. Jeez. How much is this worth? 14. Okay, not very much. Okay, another box of goods. Plus one resolve for housing being met. That was incredible for us. Like, just actually incredible. As much meat as possible right now will be good. Now, we need some people to cook. Why are you not built? Because you don't have fabric. Don't you have fabric over here? Please deliver. Rancher left. Okay, well, he shouldn't have. He was doing great stuff. Um, we also talked about getting another small hearth. And then that can go along with more housing. Primarily lizard is what we need right now. So we can do this. We have a lot of builders. But I really want the lizard resolve thing. So that's why I'm not cutting any more trees. Though I guess we can afford some cutters. And then you guys can be here. Um, you got This one got resolved. You have four minutes left. And I don't think we're going to resolve another dangerous event, unfortunately. Four more glade or trade routes. Trade routes are something that we should be looking at more and more often. Um, route? Routes? We can have two trade routes right now, so... Don't want to give up my meat. Really don't want to give up the roots, but I mean, I will. We just need number, not value, so. And the lizards are done. Two more lizards, bunch more meat, more tools. Less impatience, because we actually completed something. And we need scrolls to go for education. So that really does work out for us, I would say. We'll actually put that across the street from uh, this thing over here. So lots of building happening over there. We do have some stone. And we're into this zone. It's just a small one. Do we have any tools left? Not enough, but plus two to plank production seems a little bit insanely good. Um, ale. Ale is one of our missions as well. But what I'm more curious about is um, Oh, did I not actually build the smokehouse? Interesting. Um, bakery, one second. One second. You, you just go for it. You can use the roots, you can use this stuff, not the meat. Um, what does the... What do you need to make scrolls? Yeah, so you need wine or pigment. And what do you make? Not pigment, right? You make oil. So okay, we're gonna make ale in this case. And is this for drinking? This isn't even for drinking. But... I think it's still worthwhile. I really do. Uh, so that's fine. We'll add a couple of stone pieces over here. We're finally going to be making food. Now, right now we have a lot from just some events, but... Uh, uh, don't use that. And we're about to harvest grain here in a moment. So that should be fine as well. We do need tools. So tool shop... How am I going to make tools? How is this going to go down? We do have a set of tools that we can make, but that's it. So how can we improve that? Also, what's your thing? Good sacrifice lasts longer. That's pretty weak, to be honest. Um, not something I'm super fond of. We can get a harpy to do this. That'll give us the harpy bonus. Why are you guys so low? Because you need bricks. Well, you can use some stone for bricks now. And... There was a camp that isn't doing anything anymore. It's you. 
are going to come here and you are going to do camp stuff. And what do we got here? Lizard resolve even higher, plus two to meat production. Okay, so that to me means that now the meat... I'm not even sure how much meat production you're supposed to get. Is it just the 10? But either way, meat is just strictly better than eggs, but it requires more upfront investment, um, which is fine. Get another farmer here. You guys can make... Yeah, don't use the leather. We need that. Ale. You can make ale at two stars here. Did not realize that. If we can find wine, if we have vessels, pretty sure humans love working here, but it's fine. We're going to need a trader to, uh, to help us out with this stuff. How many of these do we, we have so many machine parts here? We're going to sell a whole bunch of them. If, if that trader were to come back that allowed us to, you know, buy more perks, then we'd be just running away with it, right? We did run out of pickled goods, though. That's going to make people sad, unfortunately. Let's do some piping play over here. Protect these uh, vegetables from ne'er-do-wells. So that's eight of that, and then we also need some night ferns. You're still waiting on bricks, I presume. Can we make bricks higher priority? You do have some, so why don't you guys just focus on, uh, on getting those out the door. So there we go, we got the building started, very nice. Oh, we never got back around to wood cutting as hard as we should have been. I th I'm afraid that this will be bad to go this deep into it, but at the same time, it is what it is. What can we do in the smokehouse here? Use meat? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is going to be so good. Jerky. And you guys can make incense. Oh, I didn't realize that that's what resin could be used for. Okay, actually, this is, this is worth using... Uh, planks on normal boards just the payout so harpies are happy that means that our uh, resolve is coming up a minute ago it was uh, our lizards that were happy but that's fine tools we have some tools you're now out of tool stuff we're waiting on tool lord to come back we'll buy stuff from them um ale i mean if we've got ale we're making it but let's do that we don't get me wrong we can get ale here. That'll get us the tavern. We can put the tavern down. Um, but that's fine. Why are people pissed? Complex food. Um, okay, that's uh, that's too much, actually. So, consider that no longer active. That is still active. Um, okay. Consider it no longer active and our wood is gonna last longer okay um that's not bad in fact we can actually add a woodcutter maybe two yeah two woodcutters very good um and you can come over here and start getting us into a new glade what do you need three new glades in not too much time we can work on that and then we also probably want to cut into this glade plus just make this area a little bit bigger everyone's prepping their fields very good we do have a brewer over here so didn't wait, wait were you making beer yeah you don't need to make beer anymore i uh i messed that up you need to make the beer and you can use roots even though we're low on food uh with leisure, that's only going to be the humans. 50% more small farms goods. Yep. Yep, that's pretty good. Uh, and you know what else we should do? Are you aware of what else we should do? We should go to our small crude pack workstation and tell them, do whatever you can to make more... Uh, 
more crap pack crops as well. Just just trust me, dude. Trust me. It'll be good. Scavengers work camp. Nothing to be done. Okay. Well, you're done for the day. And wood cutting is back on the menu, boys. And also fire sacrificing is not on the menu. We could take our people out of the temple thing, but should be fine. We do need more and more wheat, but thankfully we're getting pr more wheat production here. Every 25 times it's produced. That's not, we only produce grain a couple of times. That doesn't seem right. Every one of these should be a grain, right? Like, am I crazy? And it should be making quite a bit of grain as well. I don't know. Maybe I'm maybe I'm missing how that works. I thought that if like, you know, we have 10 squares per farmer, then that's going to be a lot. That's going to be a lot of uh, a lot of grain. It's going to be like 10 per person. So I thought our production would go up. And then as the production goes up, you get more per unit time spent, but maybe that's that's just wishful thinking. Um tavern though, that is that's a good building. People like that. And Glade, you're happy. You can have some of this. And this is a ghost chest, but it's still a chest. So let's talk about silent looting. It's minus 60 right now. Abandoned caches. So let's see what that is. It did give us some pretty cool stuff. Some jerky is nice, some purifier. Uh, making copper bars is cool. Make This is all mad though. What uh, What is your quest? What is your favorite color? Two seconds and this other thing is going to be done as well. We used to have trade goods. Um, reputation is nice. Builders can carry more is nice. Uh, plus one when under the effects of leisure. Pigments are better. I mean, I think I just need to buy a bunch of scrolls, right? Just like a ton of scrolls. I wanted to buy metal, but I will satisfy myself with scrolls. I will satisfy myself with herbs because we use this to cook. Um, I will give you a couple of these. I will give you some of my parts and I will give you some of my money. Uh, anything else in here worthwhile? These, I guess. And then reputation helps us win. This is nice though. Plus one under the effects of leisure. That only applies to humans, but which makes this not very good, quite frankly. Um, makes it not very good, to be honest. 70 religion, a bunch, or 40 religion has been had. We want more religion, but again, there's nothing here for that. We Pottery isn't bad, but... No, no, no. I think we take this. And we aren't making pigment right now, so I'm not going to worry. We are about to get six more. Um, so now we have 22. Plus one. You know what? Fine. Fine. With these trade routes, we're actually making a decent amount of money. Uh, so, fine. Making more money coming. You can get out of here. We don't have enough tools. We weren't able to buy tools there. Uh... None of, I really don't care for this stuff. What's the water skin made out of? Oil and meat? I don't want to do that. Barrels. We don't have any bars. Flour. We could make flour more efficiently. Uh, this is worth a reroll. Fabric. Very efficiency. Uh, no, no, no. We're just going to go with the forager's camp. It's lame. But we've had food problems a couple of times, and this big uh, thing has been asking for us. Whoa! A mole! A mole rat. We can go give him a bunch of food. Somebody should do that uh, right now. Minus 50 hostility means that we can stay in the game a little bit longer. Fuel burning lasts longer. A bunch of fuel. I mean, it's fine. 300 hostility though when active. That is kind of nasty. It's enough to spook some people, that's for sure. 
Uh, and then a human goes over here. We don't have a builder anywhere that I know of. You guys are builders now. Oh, also this did go to 75, so the ghost chest did count. Uh, and then we also did this one. That's, that's maybe dumb. For 600 seconds, if it was the start of the game, I would have done that. Uh, oh, mm, mm, mm. Okay, I guess we, we have to either do that or not. Six, like, 600 seconds is like 10, 10 minutes. Like, brawling religion and jerky. You are not allowed to have jerky, brawling, or religion. That is gonna piss people off. I'm telling you right now, it's not gonna be good. Uh, but that, I mean, it is what it is. Now, this is also a global boo-boo, but it would give us probably a farm that makes the most vegetables and crystallized dew, which would be actually incredible that you would ever have seen. Bunch of a little short-term grain, not that, uh, not that great. Why don't we take the woodcutters and say, "Great job, guys. Um, you're all done." And then we tell those woodcutters to come over here and bring their finest planks, and we're gonna do all of these events at the same time. And it's gonna be a little tricky, but they're gonna make it work. You are making alcohol, baby. You are making nothing, maybe. Maybe you are, maybe you aren't. We did buy a bunch of herbs for this reason. We don't have any flour, but the flour should be coming in, like, now. So, like, why... How much grain? We're all, we like How have we only produced specialized farming techniques? Grain production increases plus one every 25 times it's produced. Like, I'm sorry, but that is not true. You, I just watched you produce a grain, right? Like, oh, look at that. You've harvested grain, harvested grain. You dropped it in. There's 28 grain in here. Produced goods, 28 grain, right? Like, why, why is that not better, you know? I don't understand. Um, why are you so pissed? Holy crap crap you're starving and yeah you're not allowed to do all the things that you want to do uh i don't think that's gonna last man uh what are you oh you're the explodey uh somebody needs to get in here and send that to the queen or actually it's got copper bars we can use tools we can make tools out of that um this is something that could get eggs. So, you know, some lizards. Just one would be fine. Um, and then this here. Stamping mill makes pottery. And how easy, how good or bad is pottery? Pottery is actually pretty decent. So why don't we send a bunch of guys over here and tell them to claim the pottery mill. Should be fine, should be fine. All right, how long is this? This is a minute. How long is this? This is 40 seconds. When those two things are done, we should be fine. Right, the lizards wouldn't stay pissed, would they? Would they? Okay, maybe it's a boo-boo. But, like, they wouldn't do that. They wouldn't do that. Uh, you guys get to farming. Uh, I'm saying you guys get to farming, but really, you gotta do this, don't you? 14 tools. Yeah, we just don't have enough tools. If we could get tool production, though, that would be sick. Plus three to global resolve here as well would be pretty good. You don't have pigment and you're not making ale. Okay, gentlemen's tails. That's fine. Um, who? Who's not working? The temple is not doing anything, but... The temple could be doing something. We have wood. This could be faster events as well. Does that include all things? 
Glade events work speed increased by 25%. One sec. Let's do this and this for just one sec. Just bear with me. Are you faster? You're fast. Are you faster? 46. I don't think that's going to get better. Um, so we stop burning that as much. Then lizards. What do we do about the lizards? What do we do about the lizards? Oh, man. There's so much that you guys want. All right, well, how about that? So now they should be happy, but they don't know it yet. Now, does that mean that your thing resets? Because if I go back to consumption and do this. Yeah, it resets. Okay, well, that was never going to happen then. So we're not going to, we're going to pretend that thing doesn't exist. And it's going to, what, kill a bunch of my people or something? Kills three villagers. Okay. Uh, cool. Good for you, man. You're, you're really a uh, cool guy. You know that? Okay, lizards are going to be a little bit upset here. We are burning a lot of fuel. Okay, not going to lie. The lumber is almost gone. And I, I messed up by not uh, stopping that earlier. We don't have any woodcutters. So the problem is a big problem, basically. But hey, this is, this is done. So that's, that's cool. And we actually have coal. So we can just like call the day over oh my god it's worth burning the coal it really is look at this look how happy everyone is maybe maybe i should have done this i don't know we shouldn't be here in this mission for that long though should we oh there's plus two more grain and more perks so that's kind of nice isn't it isn't it um, you know what? Okay, let's let's go back here and we'll try it again. It's gonna make people some freaking upset, but what we're gonna do? And crystallized do bathhouse skewers. All of that I like. I mean skewers. We are not making skewers anywhere. Um, and I'm pretty sure you would like some skewers. You would like some skewers. Okay. Well, if you guys all want skewers super badly, and that will make our lizards happy, then let's get the grill. Let's get grilling. And grill goes here. And... The grill turns this stuff off. It turns on the meat, not the jerky, the meat. And you can use eggs with it or anything else. I mean, there's not that much to go with it, to be honest. You guys need to go back to making some eggs sometimes. Um, but look how happy everyone is. That's lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, safe haven. We have two of these, right? Every time 10 grain is produced. Now, again... I would love this. I think this is insane, but we've learned um, that down here, grain is like never produced. We've produced grain 25 times and we've been farming it since the start of the goddamn game. So we're gonna get uh, hostility down. We're gonna stop burning so much gosh darn fuel. And uh, that's fine. Now, what do we need here? You got four minutes. Let's look at the trade routes. I mean, people want this, fine. They want that, fine. I mean, I want those things, but it is what it is. Uh, and that's a new thing. Roots. Resin. That, I mean, I love this, but we already kind of have it. Uh, this all sucks. This all sucks. This is a $10 reroll because it's all that bad. The monastery is actually good, though. I'll, I'll give them that. I'll give him that. Because it reduces hostility by like a hundred. A whole step. Which is like actually so good. 
So you guys are making crystallized dew. That's going to be lovely. Uh, I don't know if the tool shop has been made aware that they can use crystallized dew, but they are making tools, which means that there's probably enough tools for you to get started. Uh, you should just use lizards. Two to plank production is nice, but we don't need that anymore. Like we've, we've kind of made it through the production pinch of this game. We should get chopping, but having people in high happiness is, uh, is doing a lot for us right now, to be honest. So that's going to keep people super happy. Um, yeah. Oh, and I never even put people on the vegetable gathering. There we go. So everybody's got jobs. Everybody's loving their work. Um, Maybe one less on the smokehouse so that we can have one on the grill. You're going to use the meat. You're going to use whatever you can. Scouts are idle at the abandoned cache because you, my dude, are holding on to all the tools. And you're going to kill a bunch of people? No, you you'll, yeah, but yes and no, I guess. And you guys can make pots. I mean, somebody can do this, because the, the pots are nice, I will say. Are you in neighborhood level? No, you're in encampment. Um, somebody needs housing, and it's harpies. So let's give them a house, and then humans are kind of fine. They should be, they're close at least. So let's get a lizard housing built. It's not a very pretty settlement, but it is what it is. Um, yeah, I thought this was going to be a production area, but then we mined everything out, and there was... Like, I should have waited to put that down there. That's actually a decent hike for these poor people, but... Whatever. Sucks to suck. Uh, only three hostility levels. Now, this is... Oh, yeah, because we got the neighborhood level. So that means that they're happy. Um, and you guys are trying to make grain, but you don't have... Oh, but you will have very soon because it's harvest time. And there is the trader. This one's from the call, like the royal thing. All right, bigger ovens. Very good. Forum is nice. Explorer's Lodge. Like, that's fine, like, whatever. But it's not like I... Uh, it's not like I care that much. Really, I just want as many of these as I can get, and I will give you as much everything I have, basically, that is not a permanent resource. You can have my coal, you can have my things, uh, my freaking packs of provisions, and then my money. And that's pretty close. I guess we just have to dial this back a little bit. Um, sure. So, packs of crops. I would really like for the packs of crops to be a thing. We don't need provisions as much anymore. You guys just need to make pack crops. And then trade routes. We need to look at that. We have lots of provisions. I don't want to trade away pack crops. We'll trade away some jerky and some of this. Just keep people happy. Oh, and we won. Wow, baby! Lizard settlement. 25 lizards. Royal Woodlands. Yes, Kind souls, baby. So this is pretty cool. Um, continue summit. World map. Let's go. What a, what a run. It was pretty solid. It didn't stop them from settling. But next time we can. And this one has machine parts. So... We could even just go here, for instance, or here. So either one kind of messes with the brass order. Though even blue is beating us right now because that's just how it is. You gotta play on like prestige levels to get enough points to keep up with them. So a wall segment, about time. That was in a Royal Woodland. So you're supposed to get that way sooner, but we, uh, we just happened to not do it. We were in a cursed Royal Woodlands as well. So interesting. Uh, we have enough for two 60 food upgrades. So we could get all the way up to here for lower prices on those blueprints. That would be very nice. 
We can get the 10% construction time. The additional caravan is, is convenient. So is the embarkation point. Trade routes plus one can be okay. I mean, I usually do end up doing some trade routes, but I don't find that I need the extra one so badly. Let's do this and then the construction. And plus one to all nodes is just a quiet, ha like happy thing that's helping on the side. The grace period, I do like the idea of that, to be honest. And then 10% more Citadel bonus resources is obviously an economic upgrade, but no, no, no. We're going to go here and then maybe more trading, I think, would maybe make the most sense because you do make a lot of money there. Uh, did I grab the... I didn't grab the caravan slot. But look at all these, like, machine parts and artifacts. Like, we have so much of that. Holy jeez. And I hope you enjoyed it. I really did. This is our third settlement of this cycle. It's been a while since I've played, but I'm very happy to be back. Um, just fighting fighting this orange guy left and right and you could tell that like this wasn't going to stop him since it didn't the first time but now now i know a little bit more about stopping uh these rival freaking groups it's really not that big a payout though if you recall at the end of the cycle last time the queen just hands out some freebies and uh and that's what it is i hope you enjoyed i'll see you next time ciao for now